Hi there. I'm now updating the Agama car launcher to the latest version. So let's find out what's new. Now it's installing. All right, let's open it up and see what's new. Um, from here, I don't see any difference. Let me just find out. Okay, easiest way to see is go to the settings. Now look for what's new. Uh, information, connection info, let me just click on it. So now you can show this type of icons in your screen. So let's say I want to own all the icon. Can I? Um, I can't because it's not available. So let's say I can disable the Wi-Fi, can disable the GPS. So I don't have to show the icon. When I press on it, it asks me, you have to select two icons. Ah, meaning that I can also sh choose to have mobile internet or Bluetooth. USB and battery, it's up to me, you know, what I want to put. So, you just put Wi-Fi, well, and maybe mobile internet. Press OK, back here. So, you have a Wi-Fi here, and this is just the Wi-Fi. Is this Wi-Fi? Mobile Netbook. Okay, and this is Settings, uh, Connection Info. So I'll remain the Wi-Fi. Let's try others, okay? Bluetooth. So Bluetooth is here. Click on it. It should go to the Bluetooth setting. It's not. Mm. Okay. Never mind. Let's go to USB. Press OK. And this is how the USB looks like. Click on it. Then it shows me the USB drive that I have that I've connected into this, which is a USB, which is a USB pen drive here. Yeah? So let's go and check out the rest of the icons. Uh, where is this? Okay. The battery icon. The battery icon is here. When I click on it, oh, now I can have a battery saver. Hmm. Improve battery life. But this is always connected to my car, so never mind. Next. Okay, let's try GPS. I think GPS is already. Yeah. It says that there's no GPS signal now. So. I think I just remain the Wi-Fi and the GPS there and I think that's about it this is a 2.7 version of Agama car launcher thanks for watching and have a nice day let me just go back okay bye